Hello everybody, Christian from the Coin Dictionary here, and today we're going to be speaking about the Ludwig Erhard 1990 two Deutsche Mark coin from Germany. This was the reunification year of West and East Germany, so very interesting, but we'll be going over its values, information, history, mintage, and more. First, I just want to say thank you to MA Shops. MA-Shops.com is an online marketplace with ancient and world coins, paper money, uh, stamps, and other collectibles. Really nice selection, great dealers, so head on over there after this video to purchase something for your collection. But Ludwig Erhard lived from 1897 to 1977 and was the Chancellor of Germany from 1963 to 1966. Um, it was 40 years of the Deutsche Mark, um, which was from 1948 to 2001, at which point it was demonetized and became uh, folded into the euro at 1.95 marks to 1 euro, so this was like at 1.02 marks. It's still exchangeable, which is a big part of its value, certainly for a circulated coin like this, um, but that's how they arrived at giving Ludwig Erhard the, um, you know, putting him on the coin. It was engraved by Franz Müller, um, and they produced this coin from 1988 until 2001, at which the Deutsche Mark stopped, so 1990 was towards the beginning of that. It's copper nickel clad nickel, so very similar to the composition of a U.S. quarter, um, though a little bit larger, 7 grams, 26.75 millimeters across. Um, and in terms of the different mintages, um, that's something to talk about, or the mint marks. The J mint is going to stand for Hamburg. G would be Karlsruhe. F is Stuttgart. D is Munich. And A is Berlin. Um, but on the edge of the coin, I would also um, point out it says... Einigkeit und Recht und Freiheit, which is going to mean um, unity, justice, and freedom. But there were lots of different mintages. This was not one of the highest minted coins. 1990 seems to be the year that they produced the most um, in terms of this like the Ludwig Erhardt. Um, it, it is exchangeable at any Bundesbank or a federal bank. Bundesrepublik is Federal Republic of Germany. Um, and it has sort of the German eagle, which is all over the German coins, especially the larger ones. Um, reminds me of the German imperial eagle from a century prior. Um, but the mintages are about 18 million for the D mint. And there's actually no A mint. It starts the following year, 1991, on the two mark for Ludwig Erhardt. Um, F mint is going to have 21.2 million, G mint Karlsruhe is 12.22 million, and J is going to be 18.87. So this is one of those 18.87 million that was produced in Hamburg. All of these are going to be worth minimum a dollar uh, or a euro, like one dollar and 20 cents or so. Um, but for an uncirculated one, you can expect to get like two to three dollars, especially if there's some toning, if it's really problem free. And there are proofs with mintages of 45 million from each mint mark, and those are going to be more expensive as well. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Christian, and I own The Coin Dictionary, and I'd also encourage you to visit us at our website, thecoindictionary.com, and on Instagram at thecoindictionary. And I'd also like to draw your attention to some other helpful coin resources, such as my other YouTube channel, Treasure Town, which does more in-depth videos about coins and collectibles, as well as some resources like coinmeltprice.com, which shows up-to-date precious metals pricing, as well as the melt values of the coins that you own, coinsmetalscards.com, which will both be a marketplace and a news source for coins, metals, and cards, as the name suggests, as well as whatsthegrade.com, which will develop into a stickering service for already graded collectibles. Have a great day, and I hope to see you on some of our other videos.